The war in Ukraine has proven the effectiveness of unmanned aerial vehicles. An image recently shared on Twitter shows a British Challenger 2 tank equipped with a special staircase covering its turret. Looks like the tank is operating in Ukraine. At the Army 2023 Defense Show, a number of Russian combat vehicles were fitted with 30 metal cages expected to withstand attacks from the side into the turret. These cages, often referred to as cop cages, have quickly become a signature feature of Russian vehicles deployed in Ukraine. These interim solutions, designed to counter various threats to ammo vehicles, have continued to evolve during this conflict. Among the showcase vehicles are T-72, T-80, and T-90 series tanks fitted with these cob cages. These structures consist of a screen mounted on tubular poles affixed to tank's turret. They could potentially be designed to deflect drone drop models or kamisake drones. This concept allies with the V-shaped hulls used by mild resistant vehicles for a deflection. To fend off side attacks on the turret, the case walls can be sheared with the hanging mesh. The same mesh is strategically positioned between the turret and the hull to deter drones from infiltrating this susceptible area. The cob cage offers a physical barrier, while the explosive reactive armor provides additional protection by detonating and creating a counter blast that can ward off attacks from armor penetrating weapons before they can breach the tank's turret or hull. This development was prompted by the necessity to counter loitering munitions and drones, including the Turkish Med TB2, which demonstrated remarkable effectiveness in the 2020 Nagorno-Karabakh war. As the Ukrainian conflict escalated, cob cages started being employed on TOS-1 thermobaric rocket launchers and T-62s from the Soviet era which were reintroduced to frontline service to compensate for the heavy losses sustained by Russian armor. While the protective measure presented at Army 2023 may not clearly surpass the effectiveness of earlier versions seen in the Ukrainian campaign, it is evident that lessons from the battlefield have been incorporated into presumably more capable kind of measures. These designs have evolved from ad hoc additions applied before deployment or at the unit level to factory manufactured cob cages for our domestic and export markets. These examples, potentially prototypes, are presumably ready for mass production upon large-scale orders. As militaries worldwide grapple with threats like loitering munitions, commercially available bomblet dropping drones, and first-person video kamisake drones, Russian cob cache designs could be a viable solution. These designs, whether purchased for new vehicles or retrofitted to existing ones, could appear to nations still patronizing Russia's weapon industry. Their relatively low price makes them economically accessible, and even if their effectiveness varies, they provide a sense of security. Mm -hmm.